Smart Drive MX2. So I went to my consultation at the VA for my power assist wheels and I tried out uh, uh, a few different models, mainly just two really. Uh, one where it's in the wheel, the hub made the wheel about uh, 25 pounds a piece and uh, it kind of like every time you touched it, it felt like someone just pushed you every time you touched the handle. And it was a little bit annoying and it would make you fishtail because it would take off so quick. <laughs> you know, it really felt like someone just pushed you every time you hit the, the, the hand grips. And I wasn't really digging that that much. It wasn't really helping me too much. Uh, I mean, it was, it was all right. It was an all right device. It just wasn't what I was looking for. I really was not wanting the smart drive because it was, you know, a, something you attached to it. I was worried about, is it going to stay? How well is it going to work? Uh, but when, once I was in it and, and it started going, I knew right away that this is this is the one. This is the the device that I'm, I was looking for. This is the one that's going to allow me to make the videos that I want to make. This is exactly what I was looking for, and, and here it is, and bam, we do the paperwork. And somehow I also got convinced into getting another wheelchair. I mean, my wheelchair is from 2007. It is the first wheelchair I've ever gotten. Even my backup wheelchair is ancient compared to this one. Uh, I mean, compared to the new one that I'm gonna get. They just didn't want me using new equipment on old equipment and so now I'm getting a new one although this one that I'm in is still going to be my backup chair probably because it's so comfortable and then my other stuff will just you know do whatever with it if someone needs it they can have it or whatever it will just be a backup uh, and then I'll just use the new one in this one probably put the, some knobbies on this one and use it whenever I go to walk the dog outside so it's I can just roll over everything and not worry about flipping as much I mean you still can't stop it too completely but anyways it, it's awesome I mean you just you just kind of you gotta watch and you just kind of bang your wrist on on the thing twice and it'll start going and then when you get to the speed you like, just bang it against once and it will stay at that speed. And then when you want to stop, bang it twice and it will stop. And whenever you want to stop, just hit it twice. And I mean, it's, I mean, you can try and slow it down a little bit when you're turning with your hands, but it won't slow it down too much. Your hand, it, it's stronger than your hands. It will just push right through your hands. You don't have the strength to stop it. Uh, that's a little bit scary, but I mean, once you get the hang of it, it's it's nice. And it's like being in an electric wheelchair. Uh, it doesn't intrude at all, hardly. So you can't even tell it's there when you turn it off and you just push yourself. Although you'll still be pulling the extra 12 pounds, but better than pulling the extra, you know, 25 pounds if you have the, the hubs. Anyways, there's some links in the description of the videos that were around here. Check it out.